Hi, my name is Kellogg Cotton, and I want to introduce you to the Flying Flamingo Refuge. That is the YouTube channel that you are watching now. There are, right now in September, there are about 11 videos out there for you to watch. And basically, the Flying Flamingo Refuge is a place for people to vent their anger, their frustration, and everything and I do it at the Raven Cafe in Prescott, Arizona on the third Thursday of every month. I get up and, and they have an open mic and I push the envelope this last month. <laughs> I used to talk for 30 minutes in a 15 minute uh, when I'm supposed to talk for 15 minutes but I'm up there for PTSD talk therapy. My therapist at the VA says to go to the Raven on the third Thursday of every month and just talk my heart out about what pisses me off. And let me tell you, there's a lot that pisses me off about society, politics, people, and my past trauma. Um, I have faced my past trauma through art therapy with the VA uh, Occupational Therapy in Prescott, Arizona, and I have a painting of what my PTSD looked like uh, 13 years ago when I first started to face it. So the Flying Flamingo Refuge, this is our gun range out here. And I have a computer that is older than probably some of the people that I know. And it's an iMac, it's an 09 version, it cannot be refurbished. frustration in my life. We are out here at the Flying Flamingo Gun Range, north of Prescott, and I'm going to shoot the hell out of it. Um, I never, I do, well, let me put it this way, um, I would never shoot anything that's living and breathing and organic, but I would shoot anything that was inanimate and held still long enough for my shaky hands to steady the pistol or Brandon, my photographer here, has lots of big guns for me to shoot. Um, I have a shaking disorder called essential tremors. And I, it, it, let's just say that it's a recess gene in the brain and somewhere in the family tree, several people had it. I got it when I was 40. I've learned to live with it. Medical marijuana, the CBD, not the THC and that psychoactive stuff. I'm allergic to that. The CBD calms it for at least 12 hours, and uh, so I'm hoping that I probably will have to use both hands to shoot. <laughs> but anyway, this is my flamingo. The Flying Flamingo Refuge is my front yard, and there are pictures of it on Facebook, uh, Kellogg Patton on Facebook, and um, it's a re exclusive retirement resort for sun bleach, pink flamingos, and other unwanted yard art. I have uh, the Loch Ness Monster, I have a cow riding a bicycle, I have cranes, I have flamingos. I have <laughs> My favorite is the bug shield for a white Dodge Ram 1500 pickup that went through an automatic car wash in Prescott and the bug shield got ripped off and the owner of the truck uh, was told by Driven Auto in Prescott Valley that it cannot be put back on. And so we ordered a new bug shield and my friend Charles gave me the bug shield. And there's a picture of it on my Facebook page. Uh, it sits right on the, on the berm outside of my study at my house so whenever I miss my friend Charles I can look at it and chuckle because it's now part of my yard art. So anyway um, that's what the Flying Flamingo Refuge is and I started the YouTube channel because people need to have other ways to express themselves rather than picking up a gun and shooting people. My father taught me to shoot when I was a kid and he said um, Rabbits, squirrels, and, and any varmints are fine. Uh, I did learn to shoot um, doves, but um, I didn't realize at the time you had to lead the bird <laughs> before you shot.
<laughs> and that was fun. And um, then as I progressed in life, um, I joined the Air Force on a bet and got in front of the Raven a year ago in July on a bet to talk about what I did on my 49th birthday. And for those of you, uh, it's not out there on video yet, but my birthday was yesterday, which is September 20th. And I, um, the 19th was the third Thursday. So I got up and celebrated my Air Force career of 23 years by trying on my dress blues uniform to see if it fits. I do it every year and I was able to get it over my shoulders, but not quite <laughs> against this, this belly. So anyway, that's the intro uh, to the Flying Flamingo Refuge. And I've been told too many times to speak with a lower voice at, at group therapy. I was told to use my indoor voice and I thought group therapy was to help you heal, but group therapy is what happens Everybody, what you end up doing is taking everybody else's um, problems that are running around in their head home with you. So on weekends, I would have Solomon's crap in my head and I would have Barbara's stuff in my head. I had my own crap in my head from my past that I had to purge. So the Flying Flamingo Refuge and my YouTube channel is a way for me to purge all of that. And today we're going to shoot my computer. Um, can you stop that and then start it again? <laughs>